You can see I am very, very excited today. The brand new Manchester United big time promo is out. And we're going to get into it, showing you all the standout players, all the legends and getting into this United promo. Oh, OK, OK, OK. Let's have a little look at who we have got here. Then we've got the player I wanted. There's a 92 Kobe Mainu, a 94 Scott McTominay, a 94 Amrabat. And a 94 Lissandro Martinez, who is fantastic for me. A Maguire 94, Mount 95, Dallo 95, Anthony 95, and Onana 95. But we've also got a 99 Casemiro, a 98 Ericsson, and a 98 Aroma Masaka. Let's play the video and see what we have got. Is there any soundy football? I'm not hearing any sound, which is a little bit annoying. So we're going to have to talk about it and there's no sound. We are going to go ahead and do the Manchester United events as well. Because, of course, I want to go ahead and do the events. If we can get a chance of going to Tokyo, I'll be there. It's my favourite city that I haven't visited yet. So that's the one place I want to go. Wambasaka, unbelievable he's going to be. I've got his 96 uh, United card from ages ago from United. And he's one of my favourite right backs to this day. Ericsson, I'm not very excited about. I don't think he really suits the eFootball meta. I think Casemiro will be very good. I think wan will be very good, but not that excited about Ericsson. The card designs are sick. If you haven't seen the video of them developing their cards and everything, it's on the eFootball Twitter account. I do also want to say a massive thank you to anyone that is brand new to the channel and that has subscribed. Um, you guys are literally legends. The channel is brand new, and if you're not joining the movement, subscribe to the channel and subscribe to the Kempi Plays Army. I am very, very excited. I will be doing that one. We're going to probably do that live on stream, maybe. Uh, I might do it over a little video as well. We shall see, but they may not at tour events uh, because obviously, you you know, by the time we get to Tokyo, what a fully documented version of it all. Um, let's go have a look then at the contracts. Is it just the United players that are out? Is there other legends? It's not. It's just the United ones, which is so exciting. Has Kobe Mainu got a game face? That's my main question because it really bugs me that he doesn't. I don't know how far down he is either. Kobe? Because I couldn't see him on that starting bit unless I'm being blind. Where is Mainu? Remember Saka, Casemiro, Ericsson? Is there a Mainu somewhere else? Because he's certainly not there, is he? Am I being blind? Where's Kobe Mainu? Is he down here somewhere? Let me have a little look and find him. How do you get yourself a Mainu? Is he part of the eFootball points? That would be that would be that would make sense. There he is. Look, our own Kobe. Oh, look, he's gonna be fantastic. No game face still, which is annoying. Does he have some more traits? Oh, not a lot of traits either. He's not going to be very good in game then, let's be honest. But we're going to have to get that Kobe. And he will be playing because he is my favorite player at the moment. So Kobe Mainu will be joining the squad. Very excited to see Kobe Mainu getting a card. Uh, 92 rated as well. I've got an 87 version of him uh, fully juiced up. It's a bit annoying they haven't given him a big old boost in terms of his like actual in-game... Um or would you call it? But I do want to get sort of a few of these. Leecher, we massively want. Uh, he can play centre back, CDM. Can't play left back, but that's fine. He's left footed, which is important for me. He's got a D rating as well, which is a bit annoying. But I would like to get Leecher into the side. Casemiro, I am very much looking forward to trying to get. Um, he is probably my main one that I'm looking for. Plus two in defensive awareness, tackling speed, stamina. I think he'd be a fantastic CDM next to my Edgar Davids. Wamba Saka, like I said, I love him on this game already. He will be absolutely fantastic. Plus two in shutdown, which is defensive awareness, tackling, defensive engagement, and speed, which is good. And uh, Ericsson, I don't think suits the game. I might be completely wrong. Uh, his stats look quite good, actually. Plus two agility as well. Uh, speed, acceleration, balance, and stamina. Maybe it'll be an absolute banger. We shall see. Uh, we're going to be going today until we get one of them. And then there'll be videos out over the next sort of week of me testing out pretty much all of these players. Uh, Mason Mount, I'd like to get a good version of. He can play in cam or in central midfield. Um, it could be quite a decent little player for us indeed. Um, Amrabat might be a very good DM. Might be. Not quite as defensive as I'd like. Uh, Harry Maguire as well. Might be something to look at. You know, he could be quite good. Uh, Onana, we've got a 92 version of, but obviously getting an upgrade could be quite good as well. Uh, Scott McTominay could be decent. A lot of box-to-box -box midfielders, which I don't believe is the best sort of archetype. So... Maybe not something I'd fully recommend. Obviously, there's no uh, Bruno Fernandes, Hoyland, Garnacho, or Rashford because they are all blue lock players. So that is why they're not there. But uh, let's get into some of these packs and see who we can get and who the first person we're going to test out is going to be. And as always, with eFootball points as well, I obviously implore you guys to only spend money if you can or if you want to. For me, this is a promo which I would obviously love to go ahead and get. I'm a Manchester United fan. I have lots of Manchester United merch. And for me, Man United are my team. So, of course, I'm going to invest in this one. But just if you're, if you're looking to make your team better or whatever... 
you don't need to go ahead and spend money. You can enjoy the game without spending money. And I, I fully implore you uh, just to spend money when you can. Do not make yourself silly and uh, put yourself in any sort of situation by spending money on a video game. I do it because I pretty much do it as a job on my main channel. Um, and then this channel, we do it for fun and try to get to that point as well. So subscribe to the channel so you can help pay for these because that would help massively. Uh, but let's get into it. We'll do a couple. We're going to go until we get our first legends and then we'll call the video there and upgrade them fully and see who we are going to fully up max up. Um, but very much, I'm excited for all of them, to be honest. That could be a legend to kick things off, to be honest, because as a blimp, there is no uh, multicolored on the top. So it's not going to be, but we could have a few good players in here. It's going to be Harry Maguire. Harry Maguire, which is cool. I'd like to see Maguire all juiced up. Um, he could be quite a good centre back. I didn't see. Could he be a destroyer or is he going to be a build up? He's probably going to be build up now, Maguire. Um, not that he's really that good at that either. We've got Rasmus Shaw. Shaw would have been good to get. Uh, Martial, he is a build-up centre-back as expected. In the Brazil kit, he looks good, doesn't he? Good old slabhead. Uh, head in, weighted pass, man mark inception. Blocker is good. Air superiority and fighting spirit. Um, I don't mind getting the Maguire. I'm actually quite interested to juice him up and see what we can make him into. So it's certainly something we can look into. Um, I think Casemiro is the one that I want. I want Casemiro. I've got a very good one Masaka, so I'm not that bust. It's mainly Case is the one that I want to see. Ericsson is the bottom of the one I want to see, but I wouldn't be angry, let's be honest. Um, who are we going to get this time? It's not going to be anyone special. It's going to be number 21. Is that Kulisevsky? It's Timothy Castagna. That's awful. That is absolutely stinky. A Freddy Star is the best. Malassia, Bayern dear. Some decent players in there, but, you know, I think I'm going to keep all the United players that we do get anyway and, um, you know, build a nice little United team to potentially play with. Looks like it'll be three spins with no legend, which is disappointing. Um, but like I said, this is why you don't spend money in the game if you don't pretty much do it for anything. Like I said, I, I do it as pretty much as a job. Oh, Dallo is very cool, um, which I'm very, very happy with from the main channel. So it makes a little bit more sense to me to build a second channel. And if I start doing this sort of content, I love this game to pieces and I love United. So I'll do it. But Dallo is in and that's one that I'm actually very excited about as well. And Onana, two very good ones there. The only one that I really want then is going to be Martinez or McTominay. Um, but Dallo can play left back as well. He's an attacking fullback, which is sort of what I'm trying to move away from. So maybe doesn't get too much game time. Onana will definitely test out because um, goalkeeper wise, we are struggling. We're using Courtois at the moment. I've gone through David Raya. I've gone through the other Onana. Maybe we need a new change. I think this is going to be one. But who is it going to be? This is going to be exciting. Wambasaka or Casemiro are the ones we want. And it's going to be... 19 Casimir Varan? What? That's not one. Hang on a minute. Have I been absolutely shafted? There was colours on the top. Ref. Ref. Oh, I thought we got one, but it was Varan. Oh, Jeffers. That's an absolute stinker. And now it's this. Oh, I thought we got one. I thought colours on the top, the E, when they go all colourful, I thought that meant something very good. Um, this is going to be number six, Lissandra Martinez, which I'm happy with. That's our left side of centre-back. I'm very excited to get him. But I will say, we are due an icon. I'd like to get maybe two and one at this point. Um, Leitra is going to be very good, though. Left-footed. Just a shame he's got that uh, D rating. That's not very good. It's a bit annoying, to be honest. But um, we'll see. We'll, I'd like to get him used, and uh, he should be very, very good. Um, I mean, after this, we're going to have to load up again, which is annoying. So hopefully we can get one pretty soon. It's been absolutely rubbish. We've been mugged off. Maybe they've, they've done the pack weight, isn't it? Because United, that's what it is. Biggest team in the land. I was quite excited with the result yesterday. Two all is, uh, is, is not too bad. Hopefully stopping Liverpool uh, winning the league. That is uh, as sad as it gets for a United fan at the moment. But we can hope and pray. Um, I'm going to have to be back in two seconds. All right, so we are back loaded up. We've got another two spins. I mean, if we get under 70 without one, I'll be absolutely livid. It's not... Oh, my God. They've done the pack weight because it's United. It's what it is. It's because everyone knows that United are the biggest team in their land. Or they're just not in, which would be hilarious. And we're being completely mugged off. But it's another absolute stinker. It's that Kieran Trippier. I mean, in terms of the uh, the non-stat, we've got Rashford in there and Lindelof. Oh, I'd like the Lindelof, to be fair. Um, there's, only, there's still quite a few I haven't got. I'd like to get Mount, Anthony, McTominay, all these three. How about one spin, all three? Imagine the absolute scenes. One spin, all three. Right, this is definitely one because everything's going very mental. And is it because all three are in one spin? Oh my God, it's going mental. It's the one I wanted. That I'm very, very happy with. If I'm going to get one, Case is the one. And that's the best one, I think. 
probably by far. I'm really not fussed about Ericsson. I'm not that fussed about wan -Bissaka. We have got Casemiro. I think he is going to be the best one in the actual match engine and in the game. Sitting next to Edgar Davids. Casemiro. What a car design that is as well with a nice little five stars. Brazil. Casemiro is into the club. I feel like we've been a little bit, you know, rinsed to have to do that many. But we have got it done. And Case is in. Like I said, we might get Ericsson. Let me know in the comments down below. And make sure you absolutely smash everything on this video if you want to see Wamba Saka and Ericsson into the club. Because we're gonna need some uh, we're gonna need some help there, all right, lads. Um, right, let's have a look at the players then and actually juice him up because I want to see how good he can go ahead and get um CDM case. I mean, that little card is beautiful as is. Let's uh, level trading this man up. We'll use all of these up because uh, we're about to get a whole lot more as well. So we might as well use a lot of them. Proceed to the roots on that one. And we have got a maxed out Casemiro. I've clicked the wrong thing. What a rookie. 98 rated. Now, there's a few things that we'll check here. I really don't want him to shoot in too much. Passing, let's make a little bit high. That could, that will do for passing. Dribbling, it's only plus four. That's fine. I would like his speed up. His body strength there is good, which is nice. Aerial strength, that's very good. And I'm setting for a plus four. Defensively, I feel like that's too much. Um... For that points that's using as well, I think we can then juice him up speed-wise, make him a little bit quicker. 98 rated Casemiro. These stats look crazy. Now, he gets, obviously, the plus two boost. So, wowzers. 91 defensive awareness, 94 tackling, 97 aggression, 95 defensive engagement, 94 stamina as well. Is absolutely stunning. Great speed. Acceleration isn't the best, but kicking power, jumping, physical contact, heading, lofted passes, low passes, and tight possession are all very, very good. This guy's going to be good. Head in, long range shooting, weighted pass, man marking, interception, blocker, aerial superiority, sign tackle, acrobatic clearance, fighting spirit. Let's get him in the team. I want to see him in the DM next to Edgar Davids. Um, who does that remove? Because Fred's fantastic. So we can't be removing Fred out of this situation. Um, I think we maybe get rid of Rudiger and uh, we go with him in there, wherever he is in the DM department. Mr. Casemiro. Goes up to 102. And Edgar Davids is fantastic. So it's going to be Casemiro and Edgar Davids in midfield. That is a lovely little double pivot in there. Um, as well, when we get the position training, he can slightly do centre-back. So as a centre-back, he could be absolutely crazy as well. Uh, someone to certainly look into. Uh, but do you think it's worth me going ahead and getting Ericsson and Wambasaka? I personally don't think so. Like I said, we've got... Um, a very good version of wan as is already. Uh, where's the right backs? We need to get this on a good. To be fair, we'll definitely do that on the legacy training. Um, but yeah, this wan is very good as is already. I know it's five ratings. I'm not that fussed. Dallo, I want to get on the bench, sir. And Lee Leecher will get juiced up. Should we do that as well? We'll get Leecher and Onana. Nice and, uh, you know, big time. Because uh, that'll be good to get them in. We'll legacy transfer the Onana. We sort by position... Uh, other, well, whatever, whatever. I'm trying to be too fancy. Let's just scroll, you know, that good old fashioned scroll. Uh, but yeah, make sure you are liking the video, people, and subscribing to the channel as well. Like I said, it helps me out so much. You've got no idea how much the, the little things people do make a massive, massive difference. So, uh, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and uh, tell all your friends about it as well. There's not too many eFootball creators out there. You might have friends that, you know, play the game, but no one to watch. Let them know about the Kempi army. Let them get involved because uh, people absolutely love it. Let's uh, get the old skill train. Or skill train. Again, I pressed the wrong thing. Player progression on him. 95. Hello. Um, I don't think we need that, do we? We don't need any of that. Uh, catching and reflexes. Oh, again, we aren't going to be able to max juice him. Oh, we are. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Um, what's this? Awareness and jumping. That's a bit high, really, isn't it? I think do that. Get his parry and reach up again. Swap them again. Make his catching. Oh, he puts Vaseline on his gloves, so maybe it's not worth it. <laughs> I think that's good, though. Go for awareness and jumping to that. Parry and re reach up to that. 94 reflexes, 80 catching. Onana looking like a demon as a 95 overall is what we love to see. He is our best goalkeeper now. I'm expecting good things from you, Mr. Onana. And uh, Martinez or Maguire? I think Martinez because I need a left centre back. So uh, well, let me get him up as well. Is it going to be enough? It is, which is lovely. Um, I'm obviously happy to put that into one of my favourite centre backs. He's actually on the back of my United top this year, but I haven't got that with me. So that's a bit of a shame, isn't it? Uh, but let's all eradicate that again. Wow, he is looking good. Jesus. Okay. Um, I think with uh, with him, you sort of 
you need to make sure that he's got the speed because a little lad with little legs is uh, Mr. Leecher. So for me, the most important thing is we'll give him a bit more speed to the point we'll actually drop that down again. And uh, we will give him that speed there. 93 rated, makes him a lot quicker. Better acceleration. His passing that is good enough already as a centre-back. He can come in and compete with Guardiola for that left centre-back position, which is exciting. We'll get them in the team as well. Obviously, make sure to subscribe to the channel for the upcoming gameplay. There will be a hell of a lot coming out in the next few days uh, in regards to the brand new updates and uh, playing with these players. The Manchester United um, tour I want to go ahead and do as well. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see that gameplay as well, because you don't want to miss out on that ladies and gentlemen it will be very very good indeed especially when we make it all the way to tokyo could you imagine the absolute scenes um who do we get rid of in this scenario probably like barlo to be honest well to be fair leecher as well was on d form but you know i want to get him involved is he unwavering he's standard so we'll certainly keep Vardy on the bench um and then the other one is onana coming in in goal very excited 98 over onana 96 leecher 102 Casemiro, subscribe to the channel, like the video. I hope you go ahead and get luckier than I did, but Casemiro is in, and I'll speak to you next time.